A warm welcome to all our students who are here on campus, our faculty and uh, our students who are connecting online with us. So as we started out saying this morning, this entire week will be orientation so that we can understand more about APC Bible College, the various courses, and the manner in which these courses will be taught to us uh, on the various modes. Uh, and during this week, we will also spend time uh, learning about the Holy Spirit, and um, there will be a session on Holy Spirit baptism. We will also teach from an APC publication called Laying the Axe to the Root, uh, which deals with um, you know, attitudes in our hearts. And uh, that's the first place to begin. So for us to be ministers of God, to set uh, things right in our heart attitudes. So we will have sessions based on the APC publication as well. Uh, for us to know the, the exact uh, timings of the sessions, we request us to refer to the orientation schedule for the online students. Uh, it is available in on the classwork page. So kindly download it and uh, you will be able to see uh, you know, what sessions are planned for today as well as the, the days that follow. And uh, for us here uh, on campus, uh, we've put up the orientation uh, schedule on the notice boards. So you can um, have a look at that. But for today, let me also go ahead and uh, share with us what we are going to do today. So the very first session from 9 a.m. to 9.50 a.m. Uh, is when we will uh, we had a time of worship. I'll share a little bit about APC Bible College, and then you know we will have our faculty introduction. So that's what we are going to begin with. Uh, and then we will have a short break, following which we will come back and go over the student guidelines. Student guidelines, since our online students are joining us today, uh, we will go through the on online guidelines. Uh, we also have an on-campus guidelines, which we will um, share elaborately with our on-campus students in the afternoon, afternoon sessions. But for our discussion today, we will use the online um, guidelines for the students. Uh, and even this can be downloaded uh, for the online students. You can download it from the classwork page. Uh, and there will also be some time for Q&A. So if you have any questions about our courses, uh, you can feel free to ask. So that is during our second session from 10 a.m. to 10.50 a.m. Uh, now. We'll have a 10-minute break right after that as well. And we will move into um, studying from our APC publication on laying acts to the root. So today we will have uh, one session from that publication. And tomorrow we will be covering the other topics there. So for the online students, uh, the sessions will go on only till 12 noon. Um, but for the on-campus batch, we will continue with a few other, um, you know, few uh, other things that we have planned for us. Uh, and uh, generally, we have afternoon sessions here on campus for the students who can join us in Bangalore. So that will continue. But our online students can kindly connect to the same link and uh, the main Audi every day for orientation at 9 p.m., uh, 9 a.m., uh, Indian Standard Time. And uh, those of us joining from other nations, you could kindly uh, check your time zones and then plan accordingly to connect at uh, 9 a.m. IST. And uh, three sessions will continue through the orientation week. So the lectures will actually begin next Monday. Uh, and. Uh, we will talk more about it uh, in the next session. So just a little bit uh, about APC Bible College before we have our faculty introductions. Uh, APC Bible College, it's a spirit-filled, word-based equipping and training center. Um, and uh, we are based out of Bangalore. And we want to 
once again welcome students uh, not just from bangalore we have uh, students joining from many states in india here on campus right now so welcome each one of you uh, and online uh, this year we have around uh, uh, 600 new applications and people are joining us from several nations uh, just on our e learning platform we have students who are joining us from 40 different nations uh, the new batch that i'm talking about and of course we have our continuing batches uh, which would make for several uh, other nations also you know Uh, learning with APC Bible College, and we are just so grateful to God and each one of you uh, for this incredible opportunity. Uh, it's wonderful that we can do this. You know, we can learn God's word um, and make this journey of uh, deepening our faith, uh, deepening our relationship with God. And uh, we know that. students join apc bible college for several reasons some to grow just grow in the word uh, and to you know deepen their connect with god but then there are others who want to be equipped for ministry uh, and so whatever your reason for joining apc bible college uh, uh, we believe that you are going to have an enriching time and be so blessed uh, and this uh, will be this will surely be a you know wonderful part of your lives you know a journey of your lives so we truly believe that and uh, uh, we pray that you will enjoy your journey even as you learn with us uh, the courses that we are offering uh, are being offered through three learning modes uh, on campus which simply means that students can come down here to bangalore uh, and uh, study with us we have uh, hostel facilities uh, so you know they can um, uh, stay in our hostels or even uh, you know they can study as day scholars if they wish to uh, but basically that students come here on campus and they learn together with us that is the on campus mode of study uh, and in the on campus mode of study we also have afternoon sessions for the campus residents now the other mode of study that we have is the online mode so in the online mode students can join us from anywhere in the world the only thing is if uh, in some parts of the world our morning will be their night so if they can wake up and they can join you know that would be wonderful but from anywhere in the world uh, to join the classes live uh, as we stated from 9 am IST till 12 noon uh, we have classes monday through friday uh, and the students who are able to connect directly to those classes uh, are the ones who are part of the online mode uh, and then we have a third mode which is the e learning uh, where students can engage in self paced study now if they do not have the time to connect uh, to the classes online uh, in the given you know 9 am to 12 noon uh, they can just watch the recorded lectures on our e learning portal and still journey together with the class through the semester now these uh, e learning courses are self paced and they are instructor led uh, so this is the third option and this third option uh, would be suitable for people who are working and you know they cannot make time uh, to connect to the live classes uh, but it's a great opportunity to still continue studying uh, because people can do it at their own convenience so this is the third mode that students can opt for uh, and uh, when students select courses uh, there can be again you know two ways in which they select courses one is just to do courses that they would like to um, you know study or uh, a certain subject that they want to learn about uh, so those would be selected courses but then those of us who want to pursue a degree uh, or you know get a certificate you can um, you can you can sign up for the the courses that apc offers so we have a one year certificate program uh, which is um, 
uh, we call it CTH. Uh, we have a two-year diploma, uh, that which is the DTH, and a three-year bachelor's degree or the BTH. Now, for these courses, students will have to um, sign up for all the required courses for the given semester. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, we'll talk again more about it uh, later on when we look at the guidelines. So we'll have to ensure that we complete all the courses for us to be able to move to the next semester. So those are the courses that we are offering. Uh, and again, uh, thank God for uh, technology. Um, students are joining us and can join us from uh, anywhere in the world and be benefited. So uh, once again, a very warm welcome to all the new joinees, as well as the continuing uh, stu batches of students. Uh, we are so excited and we look forward to a wonderful semester and a new academic year ahead. Uh, so we will now take some time to um, have our in faculty introductions. So I'm just going to request our faculty to please come uh, share a little bit about themselves and also introduce the courses that they will be taking up in this semester. After this, we will go into a short break. Hey, good morning, everyone. Uh, good to see you all. Uh, my name is Jay Kumar, Jay Kumar Isaiah, and I serve as one of the associate pastors here in All People's Church. Um, I oversee one of our uh, church locations uh, here, which is in Jainagar. And also take care of, uh, oversee some of the areas of ministries like member care, uh, life coaching, and chrysalis, and, and so on, chrysalis counseling, and so on. So, um, and also, of course, teach here uh, at the Bible College. So this year, uh, this semester, sorry, uh, for the first years, I will be, um, uh, we'll be meeting over uh, praise and worship, right? We're going to be looking at what is praise, what is worship, what is it all about? And uh, so it's going to be a very foundational uh, course, and I'm sure you'll have a great time. It's very practical as well, so we're going to apply what we learn uh, in the class. Uh, for the second year students, um, we're going to be meeting for um, homiletics, which is about biblical preaching. That again has a practical element of uh, you know preparing a message and sharing a message and how to do that. We'll get into the mechanics of that, and I'm sure online students and e-learning will also you know you'll also uh, find it very engaging and uh, useful. Uh, third year students, we're going to be meeting a lot more often, <laughs> uh, so we're going to look at three subjects, three courses. Uh, one is um, worship ministry. Right. So first semester, we studied about praise and worship. So this semester, we're going to look at worship ministry, go a little deeper about, uh, you know, if you feel that you're called to worship ministry and, and what, what is worship ministry all about, the practical side of it, the administrative side of it, and, and the spiritual side of it as well. Right. So we're going to look at that. And um, the, the, the second course for the third year students would be life skills. We're going to look at some of the, uh, you know, some of the skills that are required. You know, we might, we might normally call them you know unspiritual things but actually they are you know part of our ministry and it's we will be greatly benefited if we have these uh, skills as part of our lives right we're going to look at how can we organize ourselves our time our uh, you know our schedules and so on and and various other things our finances so life skills it's going to be a very practical and a very interesting course then the third uh, course that we're going to look at is uh, a book study that is first and second Corinthians, right? And uh, we're going to go a little deeper and into these two books. So, so looking forward to uh, this semester and uh, looking forward to meeting you all and also a great time of learning together. God bless you. Thank you. Right. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, so my name is Paul Emanuel and I oversee uh, APC East, which is in Whitefield and also oversee a couple of ministries at APC, which is the Life Group Ministry, also called as Cell Groups, you may know it as Cell Groups, and uh, Men's Ministry at APC. So uh, this uh, semester, I'll be teaching five courses. Uh, for the first years, Lifestyle Evangelism and Holy Spirit. So Lifestyle Evangelism is about 
uh, we're going to learn a lot of practical insights on how to evangelize, how to evangelize effectively, right? Uh, people uh, from other faiths, wherever we are, uh, whether in the workplace, college, uh, how to evangelize. And Holy Spirit is, again, we're going to learn about who the Holy Spirit is, the role of the Holy Spirit in the life of a believer. So for the second years, we'll be teaching the local church. So we will be looking at, uh, you know, what the local church is, God's design for the local church, and uh, also ministry of the evangelist, pastor, and teacher. Uh, for the third years, I'll we'll be teaching urban church planting. So this is, this is, again, a very practical, very interesting course where we can learn uh, how, how to go about uh, planting a church uh, and the practical elements that are involved. Uh, in, in all of this, in, in planting a church. So it's going to be exciting. Thank you. Uh, exciting and looking forward to uh, teaching and learning together. God bless you. Yeah. <laughs> A uh, warm welcome to all of you. Uh, I'm Deepika Samuel. I'm a part-time faculty here. Uh, for the first years, I would be covering Old Testament survey. Uh, with the third years, I would be doing a book study. Uh, we would be looking at the Gospel of John and the Epistles of John. Uh, so uh, hoping to get to know all of you, you know, even as time goes by. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Shalom. Uh, good to see all of you and excited this new uh, semester. Uh, my name is Selina Dorothy Makwana and uh, I'm an associate minister here at um, All People's Church for teaching and uh, curriculum development. I uh, write the children's church curriculum. I also oversee um, the school outreach ministry of All People's Church called Catalyst. And um, I also oversee the single adults uh, meetup and the women's uh, luncheon that uh, we organize as a church. Um, for the first years, I'll be teaching you all Minister's Foundation. And uh, we'll be studying three of our APC publications, uh, Fulfilling God's Purpose for Your Life, uh, Receiving God's Guidance, and um, uh, Code of uh, Honor. So these three publications will be studying uh, deeply profound uh, insights that we can receive from these three publications on how to fulfill God's purpose for our life, how to receive guidance even as we journey through in life, and what is, um, you know, the code of conduct or honor that, you know, glorifies and brings honor to our uh, God. And uh, for the second years, I'll be teaching you uh, Christian history and missions. Um, again, we'll be studying our APC publication and also Kingdom, uh, the Kingdom of God and Kingdom Builders, which is other two uh, APC publication books uh, which we'll be studying. Um, again, these are wonderful um, uh, publications that we have where we'll get deeper insights about Christian history and missions, which will motivate us um, to, you know, you know, to journey on and to serve the Lord, uh, just like, um, you know, people of faith who have journeyed and uh, done great things for God and build his kingdom and extended his kingdom here on earth. It just motivates us. And the uh, kingdom of God and kingdom builders, another two uh, wonderful books, which we can receive insights about the kingdom of God and how we as his people have the keys of authority and how we together can build God's kingdom and extend his kingdom here on earth. And for the third years, uh, I'll be teaching you all um, the book of uh, Romans, Paul's uh, epistle to the church at Rome, another powerful uh, epistle that he writes with profound uh, doctrinal truths, uh, deeper theological truths that we can uh, that we can receive that we can learn uh, which will uh, give us deeper insights to the christian doctrine um, doctrines so excited to teach all of these uh, courses and um, uh, it's a good time for me to study as well and also to learn from all of you so looking ahead for this wonderful journey god bless all of you thank you
Hello, once again, everyone. Uh, so I, uh, my name is Nancy Ramya, and uh, I serve as an associate pastor here at All People's Church. Um, and uh, I primarily, uh, you know, work at APC North. It's one of our locations. Uh, and uh, also, uh, currently, I serve as the principal of the APC Bible College. Um, and uh, this semester, excited to be uh, teaching four courses. So with the first years, uh, there are two foundational uh, courses, one on prayer and intercession, and the second one on faith. So uh, again, I'm excited to teach as well as learn uh, you know, these, these foundational subjects. For the second years, I'll be teaching keys to supernatural ministry. Uh, and uh, yeah, that, that'll be, you know, one uh, fun course. There's always a lot of questions. So I'm looking forward to that uh, once again this year. And in for the third years, uh, I'll be teaching Acts of the Apostles. So um, yeah, looking forward to meeting each one of you. Uh, Jean George, one of our faculty, uh, has not been able to join us here. So just wanted to share that Jean will be doing the course on Christian marriage and family for the second years. So that's the course Jean will be taking. And over to Pastor. Morning, everyone. Uh, welcome to PC Bible College. It's good to thank you. Thanks. Uh, good to see all of you. Um, I'll be doing three courses for the first years. We'll be doing uh, a course called Identity. It's a very simple course, uh, but also very important. Uh, talking to us about who we are in Christ and establishing us in our identity in Christ. Uh, second year, I'll be doing a course called uh, Christian Apologetics, uh, which is um, helping us understand and explain and defend what we believe and also providing answers to uh, some difficult questions. So we're doing Christian Apologetics for the second years. And the third year, uh, it's more of a practical course we're do doing on uh, church and ministry administration. So uh, how do you organize and administer the administration side of church and ministry? I know most of you are first years, but uh, for the second years and third years, uh, we'll be doing that course. So I was just going to say that if we could uh, just give a round of applause for our faculty. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so right now, we will go into a break. We will come back together at uh, 10 a.m. For those who are joining us online, uh, you can stay on the same call. You don't have to disconnect. Uh, we will come back and restart you know, on the same link. So you can just stay on the call. Uh, but we're going to start at 10 a.m. So thank you. See you all soon.